In this video, I'm about to show y'all boys this unlimited rope glitch that you can use to hit level 40 extremely fast. Also, shout out to the homie Dan Dan. I'm currently using his clips for this video. His link will be in the description down below. Make sure y'all boys drop a like, drop a sub, turn on post notifications, man, and let's get right into it. You can use this glitch to hit level 40 extremely fast. All you guys have to do is follow the steps in this video. You wanna make sure that you do this glitch on all of your main players, and then after you do it on all your main players, you then wanna start doing it on brand new 60 overall players. So yeah, man, if you've already done this glitch on all the players that you currently have, then you wanna start by making brand new 60 overall players. Don't worry, we're not gonna spend any VC on these players. We're just gonna be using these 60 overalls for this glitch so yeah man after you guys have made your brand new player you want to make sure that you do not skip the prelude because you want to have that summer league game now listen man this first part right here you have to do these quests that you're seeing on the screen right here first but you only have to do these quests one time meaning if you've already done this quest then you can skip to like the four minute mark in this video because that's where the actual uh, rev glitch starts. But if you're doing this like on a brand new player or a brand new account for the first time, then you do have to do all these quests from this lady that you're seeing right here. And basically all she's gonna have you do is she's gonna have you do the tour of the cruise ship. You'll get some VC and all that stuff for doing this, but you guys will see it'll show you all the stuff that you need to do. But like I said, you only have to do this quest once, and then that will allow you to do the rep glitch on all of your other players. You guys can see it's going to tell you to visit certain parts of the cruise ship. It'll tell you to visit the silver deck, it'll have you talk to the captain, it'll have you go to the mod team theater. But like I said, you only have to do this tour one time, and then you'll be set for all of your other players to do the actual rep glitch. So you can fast forward to like the four minute mark when the actual video starts. But if you're doing this on like a brand new account for the first time, then you can watch this part of the video because as you guys can see, it's gonna have you visit different parts of their cruise ship and each time that you do these quests it'll tell you on the top left hand side where you need to go like it'll tell you to visit the rest the rec center like you're seeing right here i think it tells you to meet the captain on the first deck it'll tell you once it resets or whatever once it tells you has you do a new quest it'll tell you to go visit her and then you guys can see this time it's going to have you visit the my team theater this part is kind of long but like i said you don't have to do it one time and then after that you're all set but yeah man the last one i believe is when it tells you to talk to samuel on the platinum deck i believe that that is the last quest there might be one more i know it's going to also have you go into the gatorade facility and do a drill and in that drill you literally uh you can do any drill it doesn't matter what you score you guys can see it's going to tell you to complete one workout so you go ahead and go to the Gatorade facility and you can do any workout. It doesn't matter what star you hit as long as you complete a workout. And I, then I believe it gives you a Gatorade boost for that. And then after you guys do that, it'll tell you to go talk to Samuel again. And you guys can see it'll tell you the quest that you need to do. This time it's going to have you go talk to Thomas on the Platinum deck. So you guys can see lo the location of all these people that you have to talk to throughout this video. But like I said, you only have to do it one time and then you're all set to actual do the glitch. It'll, ha it'll tell you to win a game on your mod court. So you can load into your mod court and just play against the AI and then win that game. That's extremely easy to do. And then after you win that game, I believe it's gonna have you do one or quest but you can just go to, go to your mod core and just do a one-on-one -on -one against the ai it should be extremely easy to win that game you guys will see they'll have you talk to thomas after you win that ai game once again and then the tour of this ship will almost be over with and it'll have you uh, go talk to pippa on the promenade side so you go talk to her once again and then it's going to have you talk to sam as well and this is where you actually start doing this rep glitch once you make your brand new players this is actually how we do the rep glitch you guys can see it's going to have you talk to sam and then it's going to tell you to score 40 points in any game 
So your best bet is if you're doing this on a 60 overall player is to score 40 in the summer league game because it's extremely easy to do. You can score 40 in that game um, with a 60 overall, no problem. That's why you don't want to go directly into the NBA when you make your new player. And then it'll tell you to win five games in a row. So if you're doing this on a 60 overall player, you just want to win five games a row in my career, which is extremely easy to do. And then you guys can see, like I said, it's going to have you win five games. So you want to probably do that in my career. That's going to be your best bet if you're doing it on a 60 overall. Or if you have friends with you doing this glitch, maybe you can win five games in a row on the 1v1 court. And then after you guys win five games in a row, it's going to have you win player of the game. So again, you can just win player of the game in uh, my career, which is extremely easy. Now, after you guys do that, it's going to have you, I believe it's going to tell you to win player of the game three times in a row. So again, you can just play my career for that as well. If you're doing it on a 60 overall, you should be able to throw lobs and assist the whole entire game. And that'll give you player of the game. And then you guys can see that after you have been awarded player of the game three times, it's going to give you a double XP coin. So you guys can do this glitch as many times as you would like. You can keep remaking 60 overall players over and over again, and you can get as many double XP coins as you would like. It's kind of like the same glitch from 22, but this one takes a little bit longer. It could be kind of tedious, but like I said, if you do this glitch, um, if you grind it out for like a day, maybe two days, and then use your tokens on a double rev day, then you're gonna be able to hit level 40 extremely fast. You guys can see you will get a token after you guys do this glitch. And then after you guys do this glitch, you can go ahead and make a brand new 60 overall player and that quest will still be there. And then once again, you have to do like the player of the game four times and then you have to win, uh, what is it, win three games or one game or whatever the case may be. You can just follow the quest over again. You guys can see, you can walk up to the dude and you can actually restart the glitch. It'll have you score 40 points. So you guys can do that in summer league. So yeah, man, your best bet is to do this on all of your main players. And then after you guys do it on all of your main players, go ahead and start making 60 overalls. And then you guys will see you'll be able to get double XP coins each time that you complete this quest. This is a super far way to get tokens and a super far way to hit level 40 extremely fast. You can grind this out maybe, you know, two or three days. And then once the weekend hits and there's a double XP event, you can get your a quadruple XP by popping a token and from the event. So that, like I said, this is a far way to hit level 40. Drop a like, drop a sub, man. Shout out to Dana. It's been your boy. We out. Peace.